how are you doing guys this is to plod or not to plod uh, I'm at my next location which is one a little bit chucked up out the way so uh, uh, I've been here for about three seconds in plot by copper on staircase so he's already on the phone Uh, you can see there. Uh, right there. So, from what I can work out, that the name of this is, I believe that the name of this is called Borum uh, Police Station. So, I do believe. So, uh, It's relatively new, it does. Uh, and yeah, it looks quite slick, looks quite smart. But yeah. I think it may still be in the process of sort of being finished. Maybe. Is there a reason why you're filming a police station? Well, first of all, could you identify yourself yeah, for I'm me? Police, uh, PC. And your uh, colour number? PC Lee Your colour number, sir? Sir, so, shoulder number's 3158. Thank you very much, sir. That's all right. Can, yeah, is there a reason why you're filming a police station? Uh, yep, for public interest, sir. Okay. In what, in what respect? Uh, just to see how well the, the local police get on with the local people. Okay, so... And in how they're yeah. actually treated. Okay, and is that, is that in relation to yourself, or is it just...? No, no, in general, sir. No? Okay, so how? I'm just, I'm just oh, intrigued how filming a police station is going to further that, further that for you. Well, you don't see many actual police out on foot anymore. Oh, I see you are. Okay. So the only way you can really actually get to see any number of police officers is actually at a police station. Okay. So is that, that what you, you, would you like me to relay, relay that back? You want more people on the street, in other words? Well, yeah, that'd be great, most yeah, of all. Okay. 
There right. you go. Do you feel there's a disconnection oh, between yourself, between the actual local police and and local people? The job I do, I don't really have that much to do with the local communities anymore in that respect, so I can't answer that. But that, that might be. If you feel that way, clearly I suggest then. Oh no, it's not just it's just not my just not myself. Yeah. Okay, it's been widely known. Okay. Okay, that that's the way that yeah. things are around here. How local do you live here? Do you live relatively local, like streets away or on the borough, on Wolfen Forest? I didn't say that I did, and I didn't say that I didn't. Okay, so, so no, I'm just asking because you were saying about so, disconnect about yeah. the area, so. It's so, reasonable for me to assume to some degree that you're at this police station then therefore you might be. Yeah, well it goes across the board a lot with a lot of the Met. Okay. Across the whole board. Okay. What's your name, sir? It's I don't need to give you that, sir. Well, I can say you did, I've just asked your name, so oh, I yeah, can feel and, the fact and that, as I said, that Mr John yeah, Summon so yeah, about that, the disconnect that, between the public and the police. But as I said, that that's something that you can still pass that complaint through. Yeah, I will do, I will okay. do. Okay. Yeah. Uh, well, I, I initially thought you might have been here complaining about the gate, you might be a local resident because it's the work on it stopped and uh, the cars are taking up room and that was what I was coming down just to say that we're, we are chasing this up. That was amazing. Is this a current one that's just been built? No, it's been here a few years but the gate's being repaired. Right, okay. Yeah. Alright, so that's why it's out of action. Anything no else I can help you with? No, that's it. Alright, have a good day. Thank you very much, have a lovely evening sir. Okay, so that wasn't a bad interaction uh, but why is it that they struggle to admit now he was a detective sergeant but why is it that they struggle so badly in actually saying that there is a disconnect this is what I don't get why are they so afraid to say that there's a disconnect why well it's because number one they already know that the public has lost interest in the police okay that's for one okay and they just don't like it that it's now all going against them so uh, but there's nothing more that you can really say but it just sort of makes you wonder, makes you laugh, and, and this is everything that happens. I'm very good, thank you. Can I help you with anything? Uh, no, could you identify yourself first, please? Yeah, I'm a police officer. I've got my warrant card for me. How is that I can help you today? Uh, I didn't ask for any help. And your colour number, please? It's my shoulder number. Shoulder. It's 1968 November 8th. Thank you very much. What is it you're doing today? Uh, I'm filming. Pardon? I'm filming. Any reason what for? Uh, yep, just to see how well that the police actually interact with local people. All right. Are you from around here? Are you from this area? Uh, there's no point in fishing to whether or not I'm from around here or not. Okay? I'm just asking. It, not it, should make, it should make no difference whether or not I was or I wasn't. Yeah. Okay. I'm just it's asking. It's just something that should happen. No worries. Um, obviously, you're filming a police station. There's no need for you to film a police station. Okay. I'm going to search you. Hang on. Well, first of all, let's just actually clarify this. Yeah. Okay. If you're going to use section 43, okay, don't just quote me a number, quote me the specific part of section 43 before you even attempt to do anything, okay, because under section 43, I have the legal right to actually film a police station. I'm breaking no laws, okay, a detective sergeant has only just been out here, okay, so think very carefully before you even attempt to use section 43, because if you go to use section 43, okay, I will sue you. Sue me for what? Okay, 
for an unlawful detainment, okay? Why is it unlawful? Because it is perfectly lawful exactly what I'm doing filming the police station. You've asked me what I'm doing, I've given you a reason, okay? You just now it you're states it, yeah? Station. And if you look under the section 43, mm -hmm. okay, it is perfectly lawful for me to film a police station, okay? And section 43 cannot be used in the line of filming. I'm here to audit the actual police station, and why, if you care to you actually to look, because you're a public service, okay, and I'm a member of the public, okay, and I'm entitled to do exactly what I'm doing, I'm okay. Just why. That, that's why I'm saying to you, you need to think very carefully now. And if you're going to use and section 43, if you're going to use I'm section 43, make sure that you quote me the correct legislation and I'm from 43. You, why you feel the need to come out here and start filming the police station. Well, what gives you the right to abuse my rights? How am I abusing your rights? Because you're going to try and use the Terrorism Act. I haven't okay? done anything yet. Well, you said you're going to search me. Okay, but I haven't okay. done anything yet, have I? That's only because I'm challenging you. No, I'm asking okay. you a question and, and you I, can't give me an answer. I don't need to justify what I'm doing, okay? I've told you why I'm here, okay? And that's why I told you, think very carefully before your next step, okay? And if you need to call an inspector or a sergeant out, then I suggest you do so, who is okay? Who just spoke to? A detective sergeant that was just out here. Do not say who it was. Okay? Right, so think very carefully. They not okay. say who it was. Well, just call through to your control room. They sent him out. No one's, no one called He's only there. come out, literally. He only just left me just as I walked this way. Okay. So that's why I said, think very carefully with what you're and about what to did do. He, say? he knows I'm perfectly well within my lawful rights to do what I'm doing. What do you look like? I'll go and see if I can find him quickly. Uh, in plain clothes, a little bit taller than me, a little bit chubby, shortish hair. Uh, suit? Yeah. Right, two seconds. Okay, it looked like a dark blue suit. And you said he was DC, uh, DS, yeah? Detective Sergeant, yep, he came from upstairs yeah. over in that far corner, oh, right. is where he came from. So that's why I said, think very carefully. I don't okay? think very carefully. No, you do. You can't just use the Section 43, okay, and abuse that power. That's why Section 44 got removed because of officers like you that try to officers abuse like me. yeah You've never met me you've before. gone to use officers like me yeah that's officers why like the me. first thing you Mate, actually went to do no was take to your gloves silly. out and there's actually no try and abuse silly. my rights i'm not abusing your yeah, rights yeah you did by trying to say you're going to search me what gives you the right to think that you can do that but how am i abusing your rights okay to even suggest that you're absolutely a disgrace you are i'm a disgrace yes you are it's a bit extreme no you're a disgrace to why even suggest that Okay. Why am I a disgrace? For somebody doing something lawful, you think I'm that you can search you, them? I'm asking you, why you've come down you think here? You, it makes no difference. I don't even have to answer you. Okay, Mr. Standard. Okay. Right, fine by me. But to even suggest that you're going to search me, okay, honestly, you're an absolute embarrassment. Absolute embarrassment. Yeah. That's why I told you, you need to think very carefully on your next move. Okay. Think very carefully, okay. And when you put your camera on, you are meant to inform a member of the public. It yes, you are. It's in your code of ethics, okay. okay. So, and you need to look under section three point five point five, okay. And if you can't do that, then you should be doing the job, okay. okay? And that's why I said make sure that you quote the correct part of section forty three okay. if you're going to actually try and use that. Just make sure you try and use that. Okay, and as I said, then I will take out a case against you. No worries, no problem. All right. You're an absolute embarrassment, and you wonder why people actually decide to do something like this. It's because of what you try and do to members of the public for doing something completely lawful. Okay, there's nothing wrong with what I'm doing. Okay, the DS that came down here, okay, really lovely guy, I had a nice chat with him. Right, understood everything that was being done, okay, and to come out with that straight away, you're a joke. You're an absolute joke.
Yeah, all good. I've just spoken to someone who spoke to you. I don't think he's DS from the sounds of it, but I'm not 100 sure. Obviously, I think what he said, did you say to him about obviously you weren't happy about the lack of police officers or something like that, was it? Yeah, it's called an audit. Yeah, fair enough. Um, long and short of it, like you said, he's obviously said you can record. The more people we see you and see it, obviously, with everything going on, terrorism is obviously very high. You can be searched under it. Obviously, it's our powers to use. I know you're going to say the legislation's not great, it's not, or we shouldn't be using it, whatever. Well, no, it'd be an unlawful detainment, is what it will be. What we would say, though, is obviously, with what's happening in the world and obviously terrorism acts and stuff like that, we would probably, if we wanted, we can search under it, we'd think there's enough. I think what the guy upstairs said to you is obviously, you can film. Obviously, the longer you stay here, the more people are probably going to stop you and think this looks a bit suspicious. Is that kind of what he said to you? Okay, just remember, suspicion number one isn't a crime. No, no, okay. I didn't say it was. I just said, is that what he said to you? That if you hang around here, it's going to... No, he didn't tell me that if okay, I hang, hang around so, here. So what obviously what I'm saying is, is obviously if loads of police officers keep seeing someone film a police building, they would probably search you under the Terrorism Act because they would see it as suspicious that you've been spoken to now by two officers and they've said to you, like, obviously you can film. But if you carried on to staying here like all day, they're going to go... Why is he still here filming? And even if I did, there is still nothing wrong okay. with that. But you'd probably get searched, and then if you wanted to put a complaint in or whatever, then that would be down to you. But officers would probably, the next person who stops you, will probably search you. Okay. And well, just be aware, whoever you spoke to, they haven't informed anyone else that you're here. And that, you that's, not, that's not my fault, though. No, no, I'm not saying that. But no. as I did tell you, it literally only just left me. Yeah, but I, don't I walked know that, from here I? to there. But I don't know that. And that was I? when you came out, okay? But... but Maybe what you should do is instead of actually going to try and go straight in for and saying about search, okay, maybe the actual facts should actually be put forward first. You can't go off of what you don't know, but what you do know. Yeah, and okay, what and that is the difference. Up here yes. A building. Yes, and what's wrong with that? There is no law and no crime that I've committed. But to us, it's suspicious. You stand yeah, but up just here remember, suspicion is not a crime. But and if you actually go by what the actual actual memo was that got sent out to all police stations, okay, to do with auditors, and I told you that that's what I was doing, okay, that we are to be left alone okay and to be able to actually film okay and it is in, on the actual met actual website itself mm -hmm. to say that any member of the public has the right to film a police station mm -hmm. police staff police vehicles and so on okay and not have section 43 used and that is on your own website okay but we can use okay that and it will be unlawful it's not unlawful yes it is unlawful, no, it's not unlawful. yes it is unlawful Okay, you have to have reasonable suspicion. Okay, and just because you suspect that is not reasonable grounds for that search. Okay, so you need to actually clarify and you need to actually go back and look at how to use section 43 in the correct manner. No worries, I will do. Okay, so we'll leave you to it. But obviously, like I said, if more colleagues come, and obviously, after we've obviously made obviously, it's been on the radio now because my colleagues put it up that some are filming. The next officers might search you and it'll be down to their powers. All right? I know you disagree with it, but if that's what they decide to do, then that's what they decide to do. And if you're not happy about it, then obviously you have to put a complaint in about yep. obviously that person. Okay? Yeah. Can I say thank you very much for actually taking the time to actually go up yes, right. and actually find out for me? Yes, yeah, right. There's quite a few people up there, so it does take a while to find yeah. them. No. Unfortunately, they've not got numbers or shoulders numbers. No, so. It would most but appreciated. Obviously, going forward, and obviously you might want to record or whatever, but you probably will get challenged and again. That, and that's fine. I okay. welcome any interaction by any officer. Fair enough. But, okay. but the next one might search you. Yeah. Is that fair? Enough? Yeah. As I said, I welcome any interaction okay. by any officer. Yeah, no Honest answer, are you going to be staying here for a while and filming? Just I so we can put I it up. I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Yeah. I couldn't tell you. Okay. I so may, we can tell I may, I may be done in five minutes. Yeah. I may be here for another half an hour. I don't know. Okay. No worries. I the only thing I would you. say as well, I know you want to film it, but there's also victims here as well. I know. So, that's why I've made sure that I haven't yeah. gone anywhere near the actual reception. Yeah. And when but I they see. Also, they also do sit under here as well. Okay. Um, and they probably won't go upstairs. But they can upstairs. Yeah, as well, well nobody's, so nobody's been there, okay? If okay. I thought I think that somebody is, okay, or somebody actually said that they were, then I would blow their actual face out. So that's not a problem. Fair enough. That's the only thing I would ask. Okay. No, that won't but, be any. Like, so the next officer might actually just turn around and say, like, you've been spoken to twice, you're getting searched. Fair enough? I know you might disagree with it, but that's probably what will probably happen. Yeah, but then I, get, yeah, I, I, get I, will, I will wait and see when, when I engage okay, with the next fine. officer. But, yeah, all yeah. I'm just saying to you is probably what would happen next. Obviously, because we've had interactions now with you, three of us. Obviously, we've spoken to you. Yeah. 
And that's that. Okay. That's fine. Yeah. Okay. No worries. No worries. Thank sure. you, sir. Have a lovely evening. Uh, what was I doing? I don't know. There you go. So there is her walk of shame where she really thought that she was going to use section 43 on me, but she got absolutely nothing at all. So she has to get back in her van and then she has to drive off. So, but what an absolute joke that she thought that she could get out and actually go in for a section 43, okay? Right. What an absolute joke this woman is. Absolute joke. So, but she really, really needs to sort it out. She really does look in with the vehicle running and on her phone. So, what does that say? So, well, you do realise you should be on your phone while the engine's running. Yes, I can be. It's no, you like can't be. That is what the actual law is. You're not above the law. I'm caught. You, you still got the keys and the ignition. And I'm caught. That is, it makes no difference. The law is with the keys and the ignition. Okay, so you can see there, guys, that she really did not like that. Okay, so and she can jog on.